That would be disastrous. Don't lose it before you even use it. I mean, we've used them plenty. Well, this time though. <laughs> hey bud, how's it going? If you're new to the channel, welcome. Take a seat. And if you're coming back, Carmella, you don't drive me crazy. I could drive myself. Welcome back to another movie reaction. My name is Sam. Steph. And we're, we're the, the movie, movie buds. buds. Shaw Pay's Fabulous Adventure. Yeah, as far as I know, this is the last in the High School Musical movies. Yeah, universe. Well, and the series doesn't count. Okay, we're not doing TV. <laughs> Nonetheless, Shaw Pay was a fun character. Oh, yeah, really good. I just wished that they had given her more character development, and I guess that's exactly what this movie's for. Yeah, I mean, they kind of gave her the same character development in every mm. movie. They yeah. just went back to the start. No complaints. <laughs> no, I enjoyed her character, but, you know, I would like to see a little bit more of something else. This makes sense as an intro. So fab. Yo, boy. Oh. <laughs> I love that that's his actual name. Yeah, B-O-Y. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's my cue. Okay. Okay, this well is- Well trained. Oh, okay. It's an actual production. That or a dream? Yeah, I was thinking maybe dream. Has I mean, considering the start of the movie, I'd assume it's a dream. Yeah. This is- not super high end, but quite high end. I mean, I have no idea. It looks like a catwalk. This is actually yeah. kind of confusing. I think it's a dream. Yeah, that's what I'm leaning towards. Fresh out of high school performer, getting a solo performance on a runway full of- I mean, she is rich. True, that is true. Like fairly rich mm. is from what I can tell. Yeah. The uh, auto-tune there hurt me a little. Yeah, a little, me wrong. a little harsh. <laughs> yeah, just a little strong. Mm. I mean, maybe this is just a fucking performance at what, like a business function or something? Yeah, it could be. They just set her up with a with a gig, because why wouldn't they? They would, mm. absolutely. I mean, her parents are pretty supportive. Yeah, they are. I liked how surprisingly wholesome they were. Yeah. You know, for super out-of-touch rich people. <laughs> What is damn that? Just getting flipped all around. I guess it's cool. Looks difficult. Yeah. Gotta see the dazzle that you just can't. Okay, I'm not feeling it. Mm, yeah. With the hoochie in my Gucci eye. Oh, right. The dog in the purse. Yes. Gotcha. I'm gonna shine. I was like, what the fuck? Yeah. What, what, what are you saying? <laughs> what are you putting in the Gucci? <laughs> <laughs> See, the parents are what makes me think it's actually happening. Yeah, it's, it's just actually a business happening. event. Yeah. Because mm. who dreams about performing in front of their parents? Yeah. Although Unless she really just wants people. to make them that proud. Yeah. Nah, yeah. There you go. Fundraiser. Yeah. Okay. Sure. I know. I know. There's our little superstar. Where's Ryan? Nowhere to be seen. I'm assuming he's not here, right? No, I don't think he's going to be in this, this one. Very disappointing. I know, right? Yeah. On a scale of one to 10, you were an entirely different scale. You know my aversion to scales. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sure. Okay. We'd like to introduce you to Jerry Taylor. It was so nice to meet you. My friends have been waiting. Uh, I'm a casting agent. And we'll keep waiting until I tell you how much I love your suit. <laughs> okay, sure. Yeah, she still has her priorities. Mm. I would be more than happy to arrange an audition if you happen to find yourself in the Big Apple. That would be, uh, <laughs> it would be like. <laughs> cool. Mm -hmm. It's going to star Amber Lee Adams. No, stop. Seriously, stop. <laughs> it's Amber Lee Adams. I feel like we're going to find out. I hope so. Only the most amazing performer ever. They have so much in common. Okay, sure. What's a bet she meets her and she's not everything she thinks she's going to be? Either that or she is and she's disappointed in Sharpay. Mm. Yes! 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 <laughs> <laughs> no! No! Oh. Sure. Wait, what? Wow. What language is that? For real? <laughs> I don't think going to New York is a good idea. Uh, really? Huh. There you go believing everything you think. <laughs> Ashley Tisdale was an executive producer on this? Nice. Cool. When you graduated from high school almost a year ago, do you remember what you said to me? How come no one makes a cap and gown in hot pink? No. How come you get a car and driver and I don't? I mean, she did say those things. I mean, you don't remember her saying those things? Good luck finding anyone to fill the talentless void that will exist in these hallways once I graduate? Jesus. We grew up. Savage. Well, yes, but you also said that you needed a year to find yourself. Okay. A year's almost up and you haven't found anything. Well, it's a small town. She just found it. <laughs> I did find something. 
a show I want to be in. You're talking about going it alone in the big city. Right. I mean, not really alone. She'll have an apartment funded by you, right? Yeah, come on. You guys are always going to have her back. Don't fucking lie. Nothing you've shown me convinces me you're ready for something like this. She's never going to be ready if she doesn't try, though. Yeah, you, you got to let the bird, uh, you know, fly from the nest yeah. at some point, right? Mm. Daddy says I'm not ready for this. So what does that mean? <laughs> Knowing her, it'd be a designer nest. <laughs> <laughs> it means we show him when I make up my mind. My mind looks amazing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's your assignment. God, that's such a good line. That was a pretty good line, yeah. Bethany, who I am, Jen, who Facebook Kara. Who are these fucking random friends, eh? Who knows of a New York apartment. She's rich and popular. She's got an endless supply. Sure. In a luxury townhouse. <sighs> Sounds perfect. You're right. Sorry, just uh, one button undone. Accidentally slotting it up for the camera. Sure. One adult and one dog. Coach? <laughs> oh, well, that's all that's available? Yeah, not for her. Want to set up an audition with her for a new musical. Two weeks from today is perfect. Damn, she's got a crack team. Yeah. And this would be for opening night. <laughs> you should have your own reality show called I Can Wear Anything. Where you wear anything. I'd watch that. Here's a potato sack. Wear it. <laughs> I can wear anything. Ladies, people I don't know. <laughs> New Wait, York is calling. The fuck? And this is one call that is not going to voicemail. Why would anybody else here care about that? No, she's letting them know. Oh, I don't see that. She wants them to remember this moment. <laughs> Tell their grandkids about it. That is my bedroom. And then I'm a star. See? I'm just not totally convinced. I mean, she put a lot of work into this vision board, though. I know, right? It's not as easy as putting pictures on board. I've worked everything out. I don't know. Please, Daddy. If she doesn't try, she won't find out. Alone in New York? My dear college friend Michelle has a son that goes to NYU. I could ask her to make sure that he keeps his eye on you. The mom's got a, a few. She wants to help. Yeah. She's trying. See, that works better than just, no, you're not going. I know I can do this. I know it like I know my eyes are the exact same distance apart to be a supermodel. <laughs> what? What I don't know is whether you believe in me. Mom seems to. That's right. Pit the parents against each other. Smart plan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I approve. Okay, you have my blessing. Thank you, Daddy. Just one condition. I love a good conditioner. <laughs> All right. You have one month. You have to get yourself in that show and prove to me you can take care of yourself. Deal? So deal. God damn. Short time limit. Hey, rich people, high expectations. Yeah. You know. Doesn't work out. You come back here and work for me at the country club. Work? Prove yourself or come back in a month and work for me. <laughs> it's a bit late to be trying to instill a work ethic into her, okay? <laughs> well, she should have had a taste of it well before this. Also, I'm pretty sure there's nothing wrong with her work ethic. Okay, that's a fair point. <laughs> you know Just what I'm in saying? terms of having to accept working a normal job, it's about responsibility. Yeah. She has a work ethic and has a sense of responsibility, but only in one specific context. Yeah. It's in following her dreams and not necessarily in survival because she doesn't necessarily need to know how to survive. Her yeah. dad kind of takes care of that. Yeah, for sure. I got to say, for me, this is one of those things I do not envy about the rich is the oh, expectations 100%. placed on them. And you know, nobody have ever expected a shift from me. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I can see why. <laughs> but no, it always just confuses the shit out of me when you see those rich parents who give their kids anything they want their whole lives and mm. then they hit 18 they're like well actually no now you need to know how the real world works yeah. it's like a bit late the yeah. damage has kind of been done now sure <laughs> yeah gotta ease him into it exactly i'm marjorie grande the manager for the building please follow me to the penthouse she's a grande but she's so piccola <laughs> nice place yeah makes sense only four million dollars in sydney yeah <laughs> oh yeah fucking hell to get to live in a place like this at 18 I can't imagine. Mm -hmm. Very literally. I wouldn't have handled it well. Boy, you've got to see this. I would not have treated the place good. <laughs> yeah. That's a dog. No shit. Absolutely. Sorry, there are no dogs in the building. Ah. Sure there are. Yeah. See? <laughs> <laughs> My father heads our country club board. This building is pleased to have you. This dog, not, not so, so pleased. Much. So close. Oh. If he goes, I go. Fuck my life. <laughs> Ooh, oh, that's unfortunate. That's a harsh dose of reality for you. Yeah, but this is more or less what we're expecting, what? right? What the fuck? I mean, it's New York. And what is this guy doing? Being a weirdo on the street. Stop it. Uh, what are you doing? Filming you. Just keep doing what you're doing. She's not doing anything. Who is just filmed totally stunning people on the street that you don't know? Only when I think the subject is interesting. Ah. He's the son, isn't he? And you look baffled. Yeah. And really pink. Are you paparazzi? 
No. I'm a film student. The assignment is to capture one unique New York story. Maybe you're it. Well, of all the people he could have picked. So you decided to film me without my permission. Yep. My left side is better for close-ups. That's true of all people. Yes. I'm Peyton. General rule. Something about uh, the left side being more expressive. Hmm. Sharpay hmm. Evans. Actress, heiress, soon to be Broadway legend. Yeah. Pick the one person who would probably want to be filmed the most. <laughs> yeah. Wait. That 105, but it's really not to polite to ask. No. I should know my own way. Oh my god, Sharpay, shut up. <laughs> I'm Peyton Leverett. There you go. Moms went to college together. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. This is crazy. I mean, it would be crazy, but... Mm. But it's not. <laughs> and this is Boy. Well, nice to meet you, Boy. What's up? When I rented this apartment online, it never said they don't allow dogs. It's their loss! Do you have someplace else to go? Okay, it's my loss and their loss! <laughs> the only place I have to go is home. And trust me, that is not an option. Yeah, and she's not going to consider a cheaper place. There's an empty studio in my building. I'm friends with the building manager. I'm sure I can make a call. I don't think she's got a choice. Maybe get you to see it. Since I don't seem to have any other options... There's no- There's no bellman. No. Yeah, right. <laughs> he's still recording her. <laughs> yeah. He's loving it. What a dick. Is someone gonna try and steal any of her shit? Probably. Seriously? I'm surprised no one has tried to steal any of her shit yet. Yeah. Oh, oh God. really? Poor bastard. Why would you do that, bro? This is all I have to get by on until the truck arrives with the bulk of my thing. Let her carry her own stuff. Fucking simp. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> but for real. Yeah. If you're not no. going to carry your own stuff, don't have it. Exactly. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh, well, she wasn't expecting to carry her own stuff. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> Go outside and come back in. Give me even more. <laughs> okay? It's Buddy. too late, bro. This is not how documentaries work. You gotta be in the moment. Hey, Peyton. What's up? Off to acting class. I was gonna say this actually yeah, is how a lot of documentaries work, but you know. True. Sure. Yeah. Singing lesson. <laughs> oh, don't go straight for the high notes. Cool, guys. They're loud. Mm. Hi, Sharpay. Hi, Sharpay. Hi, Hi, boy. boy. Gotta go. See you, Peyton. He's got a little moustache. I can't get over it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to love this place. I mean, I don't think you know this girl, man. Have no. you been paying attention? Yeah. It's a pre-war building. You have to walk up the stairs. During the war, they didn't fight for an elevator. Bruh. Two things going for. Got something available, and I live here. Okay. All right. Sure. That's a selling point. You seem amazing, bro. But if I break a heel, you're responsible. Get my bags. Why are you still getting her uh, bags? She's not even paying you, man. See? That wasn't so bad. Come on. Yeah. Down the hall. One with the police tape and chalk outline. Kidding. He's really invested in this uh, assignment. Yeah, we'll call it that. Mm -hmm. I know he's going to be the romantic interest. I just don't want him to be because he looks kind of like Ryan. Yeah, he does. He's a blonde dude, spiky hair. I'm just like, no, could we not? You said this was a studio. It is. MGM was a studio. This is a Roche Motel with no room service. People do do that though. Yeah, like the Van Houten effect. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> please, please stop. Sure, from certain angles, it's a bit small. This is a dollhouse! I appreciate the Simpsons analogy. Forget it! Where am I supposed to sleep? Yeah, I told you she was gonna hate it. Yeah, naturally. I see. Uh, welcome to the big city. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the real world. That is not a bed. It's a closet with a tongue. <laughs> <laughs> there is one really good thing about it. That was good. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. The shower's just right in the kitchen. Go. Cool. Mm. See? This is my place. Looking better, huh? Hey, neighbor. Am I missing something? Space, luxury, maid service. Let me guess. You're used to being spoiled. Guess? I just expect it. Yeah. Half this building is filled with performers with the same ambitions. What makes you so much better than them? Great hair, perfect jawline, chic taste. How much time do you have? That's what everybody thinks, though. You should have expected that response. Yeah. But I call my father and ask for his help. He'll make me come home and then I'll never get my big break. Well, then you got one month to prove him wrong. You're gonna have to go really hard to make this happen. Mm-hmm. Gonna have to hustle. I want my canopy bed and my housekeeper. And a shower that doesn't share a room with a kitchen. At least the toilet's not in the living room. That's a plus. Do you trust me? You suggested this place. Yeah. Filmed her without permission, took her to a dingy apartment. Yeah, <laughs> totally trustworthy. <laughs> oh, he's trying. I hope you're taking me to a better apartment than what you just showed me. Where are you taking me? You're gonna have to close your eyes. Close my eyes? Yeah, just close your eyes. Oh, God. She doesn't know you well enough. Yeah, this is, you know, so many red flags. <laughs> I know it's fine, but in any other situation. Yeah, a lesson for the five straight dudes watching this. Yeah. You know, don't do that yeah. when you don't know the girl. Yeah, this is not romantic. Kind of frightening. Yeah. Keep them closed. Hit it, Butchie. 
The end result is nice. Well, the end result is nice. <laughs> I expected the end result yeah. to be nice because they're setting it up that way. Yeah. But, you know, not everyone's nice in real life. No. <laughs> Follow me with your eyes closed into this dark, dingy room. The person I just met today. Sure. When I left Indiana to go to school here, I was just as overwhelmed as you. But I had my dream and my camera. And look at me now. How moms know each other. I'm totally trustworthy. Yeah. Look at my pretty smile. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. You still only have your dream and your camera. Well, and his mom's money. But I met you, so... Something's working out. What? You know, he's literally working out from <laughs> lifting all those fucking bags. Yeah. You just have to adapt to your surroundings. This is all just temporary. Like prom dresses and first boyfriends. Yes, exactly. I guess. At least for the prom dress thing. <laughs> Cuts to Troy just sitting alone, just <laughs> crying over his breakup with Gabriella. <laughs> that casting director be a star and have a palace that's the self-indulgent pink hurricane i've been seeing through my lens yeah at least he knows not totally oblivious mm. he likes her for who she is absolutely Maybe i'm talking about copyright <laughs> whoa <laughs> <laughs> you get little bits and pieces of this song in there yeah you poke her, I'm gonna lose all respect for you. Yeah, don't fuck with her. Give us some money and leave. Yeah. I don't understand those stone couches. You know what this couch really needs? Just solid rock. Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> look, if it's gonna be outside, just be a regular fucking park bench. It's yeah. fine. We know it's gonna suck to sit on. Yeah, we've all accepted this, okay? <laughs> don't make it worse. Yeah. Don't make it look like it's gonna be comfortable. Yeah. And then for me to find out, it's fucking shit. I know that. Oh, don't eat the bug. <laughs> Why? Oh, actually, you know what? Yeah, he'd be fine. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure. Real New York hot dog. What? It's just plain. There's yeah, nothing else on it. That does seem pretty fucking boring, dude. It's just like something sociopath seed. Yeah, well, you didn't put anything on it. No sauce, nothing. No cheese, no onions. You're insane. Come on, man. You're unhinged. We don't all have to agree on what toppings, but you gotta have some yeah, toppings. Yeah, yeah, no, that's just principle. Right? I want you. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, naturally. She's already when, thinking it. When doesn't she? <laughs> <laughs> Are they seriously repainting her apartment? Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, don't get me wrong. The repainting, sure. Put the work in. Although him, yeah. bro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, also you just damaged your shit out of your camera. <laughs> hmm. Don't get me wrong. It's, I'm all for being a nice guy, but do you not have shit to do? Yeah. I'm, I guess the filming uh, is yeah, the thing that he has to do. Yeah, I part of it. <laughs> that is so cute. She gave him a little fold up bed like hers. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> 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 oh no! Help! Oh, she's <laughs> upside down. Oh god. How did she get out? Knock, knock. Come in! I guess she figured. Jesus Holy Christ. Crap. Wow. And wow. Bro, if the performance thing doesn't work out, you have a future in interior design. Not many people can say they're there to film the creation of a legend. Hey. Oh, oh no. yeah, crying girls. That makes sense. Hey, you made it after all. Destiny called? And I get great reception. What's tomorrow like for you? The first day of the rest of my fame. <laughs> okay. I'll email you the musical number that we'd like you to prepare. Make sure that he's well-groomed, takes care of any business beforehand. Wait, what? We don't want him to poop on stage. Wait. It's your dog that we want to audition. <gasps> oh! Damn. Oh my God. I sent you all the information in response to your email. <laughs> Read it. Didn't the title of the musical give you any indication? A girl's best friend? Oh, uh, no. And I'm here for the girl. You're here for the girl? Well, I'm never the best friend. <laughs> oh. oh. No, no, we wanted boy. As the girl? <laughs> you want boy as the best friend of the girl? Exactly. Then who's the girl? Already taken. There's yes. a poster. Yeah, that's true. If you don't want boy to audition, I would totally understand. Hey, don't hold back his dreams. Yeah. Stop trying to live vicariously through your child. <laughs> <laughs> you horrible monster. Uh, I like yeah. we're getting some doses of reality here. <laughs> some? Some. It's not even me they wanted. 
let's be honest, she's still got a real nice place. Oh yeah, that's true. In fucking New York that she was able to do up. A dilapidated, black mold having, stinky apartment was. in Sydney has gone for over a million dollars. So yeah, you are absolutely correct in mm. that regard. And I'm pretty sure New York's a little bit above Sydney. Yeah, more expensive expense. than us. And like, I know we're high up on the expensive cities list. But they're higher. They're higher. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Nothing is turning out the way I planned it. What do I tell my father now? I'm just like everyone else. Maybe a little better. God damn. That was a glimpse. Boy, is your dog. Be happy for him. You gotta work yourself into being something special. True. You're right. And being when you do something for yourself, even though it's not so good for other people. And she's got the makings. Hey, she puts the work in, that's for sure. She has been putting in the work, mm -hmm. but you just gotta keep doing it. Do more. Yeah. Selfish? Oh, yeah. I like that she has some self-awareness. Yeah. You can't give up. You're officially the star of my film. I am? Yeah, you are. Well, have you not noticed? Now it's all about you. Only because I need you here. He's kind of only been filming you. He's been following you around for mm -hmm. a while now. Fine, I'll star in your movie. You have been. What? Okay, change of strategy. I didn't know you had a strategy, but I like the way you think. <laughs> yeah. If boy becomes a success, everyone will see me as well. Yeah, sure. I am the one who's holding his leash. <laughs> will ultimately lead to my fame. That's what I came here for, right? Still a little selfish, but heading in the right direction. As uh, long as you still have your eyes on, you know, his... We're gonna do this. ...well-being too, I agree. Oh, I'm sure she will. If you can't see the bright side, polish the dull side. Working as a team. He is going to be the Paris Hilton to her Kim K. Oh, so I'm thinking it's more like a Matt Damon and Ben Affleck sort of situation. Mm, yeah. You know. Which one's Matt Damon, which one's Ben Affleck? <laughs> <laughs> when you look at the world and the world that you see, Yes, rough. <laughs> Sit back and watch us do our stuff. Two, three, four. Cute. Go, there you go. We're gonna see. Aww. We're gonna nose our way into your hearts. Doing it. Good work. Bark into part harmony. Excellent. They're smitten. We'll bow together. Count out three. Aww. My boy. We make the Boy is vying for that top spot. Yeah. He's gonna depose Bruiser. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the aesthetic has a bit more Elwood's light in this one. Yeah. Me and my boy, my boy and me. Well, you know what? You guys put some good time and effort into this performance. Well done. Yeah. I hope you got some solid treats out of it. He's clearly oh. waiting for his treat oh, now. He got all the treats. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you go. They love it. Nice. That's the best audition I've ever seen. It makes sense. Damn straight. Yeah. She does put in the work. Oh, yes. Shills, feel my hand. I won't feel your hand, but I believe you. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> that is one special dog. I appreciate that. Boy was meant for Broadway. We both were. Yeah. There's one more waiting. Ah. One more! One more, people! <laughs> Guys, please lay off the coke. <laughs> Take a seat in the front row, please. Now. Yeah. Yeah, don't fuck with the stage people. True story. They, they got a job to do too, mm -hmm. you know. Now we get to see the competition. Mm-hmm. Gonna blow her out of the water? Probably. Oh, All right. Oh my God. It's just Ryan. Holy shit. <laughs> That'd be the <laughs> ultimate villain arc. Oh shit, okay. Okay. Cute kid, huh? Roger Elliston. The third. Okay. Yep. And his dog, Countess. Sure. Countess. As you can see by our extensive resume, Countess has numerous major Broadway credits under her paws. The Collar Purple. <laughs> the, co the original Broadway production of A Wagging Tale of Two Cities. Oh my god. Cool. I'm impressed. This is us impressed. Cocaine's a hell of a drug. Yeah, a little too impressed. She can bark a high C. Maybe, what? With sustained vibrato. What? Sure, but only dogs can hear it. Yeah. <laughs> Relatively fair, right? Oh yeah, of course. Okay, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, it's no Bruiser and Leslie. Just saying, <laughs> I'm just saying. Let's see what Countess can do. Times are extremely tough. The world that you see is rough. And you need some cheering up. When you see someone like Sharpe and you think they're disconnected from reality, and then you see a kid that dresses like this. Yeah. In all seriousness. And has <laughs> these kinds of expectations. Yeah. Yeah. Oh shit, he's going for the remix. Okay. We're gonna sit and shake your hand into your heart. Into part harmony. Yeah. I think 
think it's a comparable performance. I don't think he's blowing her out of the water, though. I don't think so either. Solid, though. Yeah, for very, sure. Very good. My girl and me. Perfect pair. I don't know. In terms of choreography, I think hers was more impressive because I feel like mm. Boy was more involved. Mm, I agree. Me and my girl. Oh, okay, that's pretty cute. See, he's not done yet. Oh, the jump through a hoop, really? Okay. I, I don't know. No, I... Oh. Okay. It was still very close, but <laughs> I don't know, man. Yeah, I think I like Chopez more. I feel a little bit more even about them. That's the best audition I've ever seen. Uh, but... but I weeped! Wet yeah. theater weeping. <laughs> but you, you're not doing that. Yeah. Amberly thoughts! Again. Guys, lay off the coke. Mmm. Now oh, that was the big star that Chopez mm. was talking about, huh? Yes. Right. <gasps> Wait, what? You didn't know if wow was a word? I just hope that the chemistry surgery between you and I right now huh? won't in any way influence your decision towards our superior audition. Shut up, kid. Yeah. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. How old are you? Twelve. I think I'm good. It yeah. shows. <laughs> yeah. And you! Your dog! Wow! Wow. 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 <laughs> I'm a mega fan. Oh, you are not. <laughs> so am. Obviously she is. I am going to tweet about you. I follow your tweets. She did. She tweeted. <laughs> Exciting. She had to confirm that. Yeah. You're amazing. All this and a grade school diploma. <sighs> My guy. This kid is like the definition of punchable. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Broadway's not like film or television because with Broadway. Yeah, it's on a stage. Yeah. Real people are watching. What? Well, are you saying real people don't watch movies and TV? So excited to be performing on the Great White Way. Yeah. I think she's talking about the direct connection with the audience. That makes sense. She just said it badly. Yeah. Mm. Only one can be in the show. How about we work with both dogs during- Wait! How about we work with both dogs during rehearsal? <laughs> That's a pro move. That sounds like a solution. <laughs> that shouldn't have been that funny. We have a solution, people! Fuck. God. I love how she waited for him to finish his sentence and then just perfectly oh, yeah. replicate it. Yes. Not even pretending <laughs> like she's not stealing his Absolutely shit. Absolutely <laughs> hijacked it. <laughs> I think they loved you. You're such a good singer, and I would know. My album went triple platinum. Cool. I'm gonna have my assistant give you my phone number if there's anything that you need. I'm gonna call it now. She's gonna turn out to be the bad guy. Sharpay's gonna team up with the assistant to take her down in the end. Okay. It looks like any ordinary number, but it's not. It's yours. I definitely don't think that she's going to help the way she's saying. We shall see. Mm. I am suspectical. Yes! I kind of like it if there's no actual bad guy. Yeah. We don't necessarily need to have a villain arc. True. Amber Lee really likes you too. Is she awesome or what? I mean, how do you know? Isn't she a professional actor? Mm-hmm. We are so going to get that part. How do you know? Easy. I don't do rejection. You should. Yeah. You have to if you're a professional. I just wanted to wish you both luck. Oh. And suggest that you give up now when you still have your dignity. I was waiting for that. There it is. This play date's over. What? I hope you enjoy rejection. We're gonna destroy you. Bring it on. Oh, it's brought. Hey, Chope, maybe stop trying to win this competition with a 12 year old. Mm. You can let this one go. Let's be real. They have the exact same level of maturity. Mm. Aww. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> Star-crossed lovers. Good boy. Good boy. Aww. Let's try our next one. Catch your tail. Good. Yeah. Do you have to talk in the baby voice for him? Apparently dogs like it. Really? Yeah, they ran tests. All boy can do is think about how horrible that mangy dog was. <laughs> oh yeah, that's what he's thinking. Uh -huh. God only got one book published and look how well it did for him. Huh. Um, okay. What's wrong with being confident? Arrogance is when you think others know you're good. Uh, I think it's more complicated than that, but sure. I feel it's when you feel that you're better than other people. I think it boils down to just having an unrealistic expectation or idea of your place yeah. in the world. And yeah. obviously you have a higher opinion than you should. And you're a dick about it. Generally. Yeah. Not always. But mm. Yeah, generally. And do you have to film everything? If my professor loves my film, then it gets in a festival, then I'm signing a studio deal, then I'm getting an Oscar. That simple, huh? Okay. I always knew I wanted to be an actress. I produced and performed Snow White. I made my brother play all the dwarves. Of course you did. All of them? Everyone in that preschool worshipped me. Somehow. God damn it, Ryan. He is that talented. You marvel of a human <laughs> being. I just want to wake up every morning and be on stage. See, that's why they couldn't make a Ryan movie. He's just too perfect as it is. <laughs> Welcome to the first rehearsal of Girl's Best Friend. <laughs> <laughs> 
There's no growth left to be had. No. <laughs> this is the opportunity of a lifetime. Broadway is not like film or television. Yeah, I just don't believe anything this woman says. Yeah. Because with Broadway, people can see if you write your lines on your hands. <laughs> yeah, she just comes off as quite fake. That's why I think she's going to be the villain. Mm. Amberly and Judith, I want you on stage so we can block that first scene. All right, let's start with boy. Yeah. Recognize second place. Of course. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah. I love how they've got the opposite colors. Yeah. She's got the blue and he's got the pink. Pink used to be for I young know. boys. That's what I'm saying. Mm. I like it. Yeah. I have to, Mom. Fame and fortune. Actually, reverse that. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that funny? I'll explain later. Just keep going. If you have to explain the joke, it's not funny. The fact that she doesn't understand that that should be a joke. Yeah. Leaving Shelby behind. Help. Shelby, what's in this very wet envelope? Yeah. Again, I don't, I don't get that. Dude, holy crap. Gasp! That's a stage direction. Yep. <laughs> Simple mistake, keep going. <laughs> Uh huh. Trying to run away with my boarding pass will change. Leaving at 8 a.m. Maybe just brought it to you. Yeah. 6 a.m. <laughs> Yeah, see, these are the real moments of her. Yes. And they're not good. <laughs> no. I wish I could just back you up and do a little doggy bag. Let's get Countess in there and continue. I mean, I think he'd fit. Yeah. Shelby and I will both be here when you get back. Oh. Aww. Aww. Let's travel. Aww. Pulling out all the stops. Mm. You're right, Shelby. Let's see what New York has in store for us together. Whoa, it's just like Chopin's life. Dude, really? Bruh. Come on, man. Oh, oh so cool. Uh, I guess Sharpay was really just ahead of the game this entire time. Oh, what what's going on? Just going to town. <sighs> the dog. What what is this? I think they noticed the smell. You'd think. Cause uh Raw chicken fucking stinks. It really does. Mm. Even just the chicken juice or whatever, that yeah. fucking smell. Get me the other dog. What can you do? Also, would that not still have the same effect on your dog? You'd think so. Would she change shoes during takes? Thing that breaks my heart. Why? <laughs> Why did she change shoes? <laughs> really? <laughs> okay, I get the hey. idea is that no one's supposed to be able to hear this. We're only hearing it because yeah. to show the dog. Why is she twirling? What is she doing? Figure out what's going on with the dog. It's not helping me. He's gonna play dirty. Yeah. Sorry. What can you do? Uh, don't play dirty with a 12 year old. <sighs> That's what you can do. If he screws up her performance though. Dude. What does she do about that? Dude, don't play dirty with a 12 year old. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Okay, considering the size difference, that cat would have fucked him up. Am I the only one bothered by this? That's 10. So punchable. That's right. Get him. Get him, Sharpe. I'll admit you're good, but we're better. <laughs> Just toss him off the stage. <laughs> He's 12. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. I have to take the dogs for a nap. Union rules. Fair enough. The dogs aren't taking the nap, he is. <laughs> <laughs> He's taking the dogs and taking a, a nap. nap. Yeah, they're just there for comfort. Yeah. You break first. No, you break first. <laughs> Oh, seriously? The staring competition? Yep. Okay, actually, Sharpe, are you 12? <laughs> She's supposed to be like 19 here? Yeah. Aww. Pretty cute, huh? Yeah, yes, they are. I just wanted to tell you something. Very concerning. Something Why are you closing the very door? Very mean. This is my show. This bitch! Are you serious? They're paying to see me, not you two overbred furballs. Dude, are you, are you for real? I can figure out a way to get rid of you. What the fuck? You better watch your stuff. Why would you want to get rid of them? Otherwise you'll find out the real meaning of going home in a doggy bag. Why are you telling your plan to these dogs? <laughs> they don't understand. And why would you run the risk that they do? Yeah, or that there's someone else listening. Yeah. <laughs> God damn. The film is cutting together really well. The camera loves you. <laughs> I know. We can relate to that. What? Camera loving us. Oh, sure. <laughs> My dad's video chatting me. I can't let him see that I live in a tiny studio in a filthy tenement. Look at this fucking place. Are you serious? It's a really nice place now after you did it up. Yeah. Apparently has never heard of the word maid service. No offense. And that just goes to show how capable she really is. Mm, I know. What do I do? Why? What? Is he going to use a green screen? Oh, right. Oh. Hi, Daddy. Hey, Princess. Oh, because he still thinks she's in the other place. Yeah. Overpaying for everything and yelling at total strangers. So she's just got a nice backdrop. Hey, where are yep. you? That view? On the balcony. Yep. Well, there's hardly a penthouse in the city that doesn't have a spectacular view. Uh, so, you're the toast of Broadway? Totally. 
Mm -hmm. Most definitely. The last time no one's heard from you for this long, when you found out your gold card wasn't actually made of gold. Okay. Fair enough. Yeah. You got into the show? Well, it doesn't quite work like that. It's complicated. Sharpay, is there something you're not telling me? Many things. Oh, yes. You remember the deal, right? Why do you think she would tell you any details when you gave her this strict deal? Right. <laughs> you have two weeks left. I set rigid boundaries for my child. Why don't they tell me anything? Yeah. It's fine, Daddy. <laughs> Okay. A month, man. Yeah. Holy shit. We miss you, Angel. Miss you too. I love you. Dude, why? Boy has to get that role. He can't go home. Not as a failure. Yeah, that's probably the unhealthiest part of her mentality. Yeah. What do you mean you forgot my bottled water? I was going to get those magazines that you said you wanted, and I got hit by a bike messenger. And meanwhile, I had no water! I am so sorry. I am so sorry. I, I will do better. Forget cool. it. Yeah. Catching some shade from the shadow cast by your madam's apple? We Ooh. knew they were gonna do this. Here. <laughs> Fired! Yeah. Jesus. They had to have someone worse than Sharpay had ever been in any of the other movies. Mm. But I mean, yeah, I never really felt like Sharpay was a villain. No, not you know really. I mean? She was somewhat of an antagonist for the stories, I suppose. Yeah, plenty of potential to be a better person, though. Yeah. You look so cute, Sharpay. Sharpay. Oh, you changed it. I like that even better. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah. I just saw your assistant leave in tears. She quit. Why would mm. she be in tears about it? Yeah, I don't think she even really cared. What? Sure. I should probably just hire a best friend instead. Oh, no. No, no. Oh, don't do it. The one time you have the humility to play second fiddle to someone else. This isn't the time. <laughs> Worst possible person. You're right though. Role reversal. She is Kim K now. Yeah. I could help you out. Can't in any way affect your decision. I couldn't live with myself if I thought I did anything unfair. Sure. How about dinner? That sounds awesome. Get me a reservation for two. Then call my agent and have her meet me. Yeah, she didn't mean you guys are having dinner. She's saying yeah. you organize her dinner for her. You're her assistant now. It won't be because you're helping me if I happen to take extra liking to girl. Boy. Oh, you changed it. I like that even better. Holy crap. Wow. Take my mic down to the sound guy. The wire hurts my scalp. Pretty sure this woman's a sociopath. Mm. Amber Lee says the wire is hurting her scalp. I think she's using the wrong shampoo. You're hot. Dude, oh, what? no. No, buddy. Excuse me? You're hot? Come on, stop. man. Stop. Stop. That's a little rude, don't you think? Your mic's hot. Oh. Oh. Cool. It means it's on. You see that it's going through the entire theater. Oh, oh dear. I could have led with that part. Thank you. He tried. Amber Lee's got a great scalp. Cool. Yeah. Uh, you're hot. <laughs> he knew what he was doing. <laughs> Boston. He's literally just <laughs> fucking with her. Yeah. <laughs> that is kind of funny. I appreciate that. Yeah. This isn't wise. Amber Lee will see that she and I are exactly alike. Boy gets rolled, then his fame becomes my fame. Oh, dude. Come on, man. Isn't it more like taking advantage? It's turning out better than I imagined. Really? I know the roles were reversed last time, but come on. When you had an assistant in the third one, didn't go so well. Yeah. Hello. Sure, be right over. Yeah, well, I mean, I guess she's getting some of that reality that we oh, were talking yeah. about, so, you know. It gets some. Yeah, also, living the fucking delusional fantasy life of a drama queen. Not what I'd call reality. Yeah, she's still a rich girl, but you know what I mean. That's yeah. why I say it's some. Oh, yes. <laughs> I just, I can't reach that. Wow. Can't reach it? Oh, okay, it was a little bit of a test. Okay. Mm -hmm. Only a true friend would come all the way. A true friend? Dude. Interesting word. So I passed. She is fucking evil. Yeah. <laughs> but seriously, the first. Oh. She's not taller than you, though. Yeah. Like, I'm pretty sure she is going to try and kill the dogs. Oh, uh, yeah, maybe. Oh, fabulous. <laughs> nice. Make sure I look as fabulous as you always do. You have to tell me all your secrets. Okay, gotta go. Yeah, just get more free labor out of her. Why not? Hang on, is she not paying? Dude, I doubt it. Oh, yeah. Because we're best friends, right? Mm. Jesus Christ. Shelby and I travel halfway across the country to- Hey! How about dinner? Split some egg rolls that walk this way? Ha. Huh. Walk this way. Nice. Can't. I have to highlight script changes. Why is his place seem so dingy? But I miss spending time with you. In comparison, I know it's just the lighting, but like- Man, the comparison. You did promise to shoot some more stuff for my film. You know what I'm doing is important too. He's a dude. I know. <laughs> Guess Have what a fucking with. lamp. <laughs> yeah. Lamp. <laughs> there, you sounded like Amber Lee. But I've got a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Bad news. My maid quit. There's a list of chores. Oh. Maid now too? Yeah. She's everything. I want to talk to you about boy. But you have to promise it'll stay between us. Yeah, sorry. Okay. Just uh -huh. keep baiting. I think I'm going to ask the director to give 
boy the part. Yeah, she's baiting. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I mean, it seems pretty obvious she was going to do that, but you know. Yep. You won't be sorry. She's just baiting on the world to change. <laughs> she's baiting hard. Yeah. <laughs> she's a master baiter. Yeah. Oh, oh <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't get to that first. <laughs> I know. Wait, what's... Jesus. Jeez. Oh, yeah. Dude, you're not even getting paid. I know. And she was so I upset think. at the idea of working for her dad. Yeah. Yeah, she... Oh, what? Okay, no, dude. See, I'd believe that more if she was just trolling. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, I guess, realistically, the filmmakers are trolling us. Yeah. yeah they are trolling us. Oh, God. Yeah. She got the poo brush in her hair. Oh, no! It, I, oh. I really hope that's a brand new poo brush. It's never been used. You know it's not. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> you need to get a haircut. Oh, you need to just shave it all off, man. <laughs> Start all over. Countess can learn these in no time. She's got a memory like a digital hard drive. No barking all megabyte. Funny. Okay. I need to find Sharpay and make sure she gets them. Boy is doing the first run through tomorrow. I'd be more than happy to deliver them. Please don't tell me he's stupid enough to. Right? He, yeah, is, he is. He's that stupid. Uh, you know what? No. Thank you. He just doesn't care enough. <laughs> uh, yeah. He's like, hey, I did my job. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. <laughs> I'll take that. Yeah. Sharpay. Uh, you're just going to throw them out. Yeah. It's it kind of long and hard. Yeah. He's the kind of tool that wears a fucking sweater over his shoulders. Mm. We have something to ask you. He's supposed to come from the other side of the stage. We changed that blocking line. What is wrong with this dog? Goddamn. Yeah. Jesus Christ. A little bit of the true face came out for a I, second there. I appreciate that basically everyone there is like, but hang on, what? Yeah, yeah, that's good. Yeah. These people have some sense. It's not his fault, he's just a little dog. Like, what is the crazy lady talking about? Yeah, I guess that's the difference between the adult world and high school. We sent out the script changes, but boy didn't do them. But I didn't get any new script change. Yeah, unfortunately. <sighs> you gotta really make sure people hear you about that one. Mm-hmm. Because as you can see, they'll just fucking walk off. Yeah. Ask him, what happened to it? Why mm. didn't I get it? You did this on purpose. Obviously. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, I appreciate that. he doesn't lie. Yeah. Countess doesn't have half the personality that boy has. Boy doesn't have half the talent the Countess has. Okay. Isn't that right, girl? Guys. Oh, oh they, they ran off together, didn't uh, they? Boy? Nice. Ha, <laughs> they're eloping. Boy! <laughs> <laughs> Nope. This kid just saw something he wasn't meant to see. Countess! Boy! Countess! Boy! Oh, gross. I'm pretty sure somebody peed on that door. I'm pretty sure this whole area has been peed on at least a thousand <laughs> times. It's gone a nice, <laughs> even coat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Boy and Countess are gone! It's the city, man. Yeah. What? We have to find them. We're gonna look around here. Can you look near the apartment in case they come back? Of course. Just keep me posted and I'll call you if they show up. <laughs> You can see like the exact tea stain. The trajectory. <laughs> <laughs> the pizza. Countess is uber sensitive. She cries watching dog food commercials. What? Oh, yeah. That makes sense. They went on a date. Whenever. Isn't that nice? You want my love. You got a trash pile. Yep. <laughs> hey, he's taking her to an all you can eat buffet. Okay. <laughs> sure. Hey, they snuck in. I like to think the driver knows he's just yeah, like, Yeah, he's just cares. like, mm, whatever, they're yeah. cute. Who gives a shit? This song. Baby, baby. Oh, okay. It took me a second. Yeah, same. Because they used a cover. Baby. Is this not the original? No. I'm How can you tell? Voice is different. Baby, oh. Pretty sure. I guess it goes to show how much I know about Justin Bieber. <laughs> Smart dogs. Smarter than we are. Hey, emotionally at least, for sure. <laughs> No, it's my dad. I just can't deal with him right now. And yeah, oh. they become friends in the end. Go. How did you find them? Countess! Boy! Maybe they found him. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna bond over their shared love of their dogs. Of course they are. Thanks, Peyton. Yeah. Intro pay? It's still on. Yeah. Oh, bring it. Calm down, mate. At least there's like a friendly rivalry yeah. now. I mean, they're two rich kids. I know. You'll be fine. Yeah, they'll both be fine. There are no real stakes in this. Yeah. Let's be honest. I'm just glad you're okay. Because as you know, we hate rich people. <laughs> are you so lost in what you're doing that you haven't noticed? Boy and Countess are in love. With what? She has not <laughs> noticed. Holy shit. Each other. You're right. How can oh you my. tell? He's dilating. 
related. What? She knows her child. Yeah, apparently. Holy shit. How could I not notice puppy love? Oh, there's a lot you haven't noticed. Yeah, she's not very observant. Lately, you've had no time for me. I was counting on you to help me finish my film. She cares about music theater and that's about it. Mm -hmm. Things have become complicated. Amber Lee is using you and you're letting her. Yeah, that's true. That's very true. Where's the Sharpay that didn't want to work for anyone? Why don't you tell me? Working for someone. I wish you'd brought this up earlier though, bro. He hasn't seen her in a while because she's been so busy. Yeah. I know what I'm doing. You definitely do not know what you're doing. You've sold your soul. Maybe you're jealous because I'm on my way up and you're just a student making a film about someone else's life. Oh. Ooh. Oh no. You're not going to be happy you said that later. Yeah. You don't have to be in my movie anymore. You have more important things to do. Hell, I think she's not happy she has said it right now. Yeah, I think that was that instant regret, but too proud to admit it. Mm. What happened to that hot pink whirlwind? That girl knew she didn't have to do any of this to succeed. I mean, yet knew her for like a few days at this point. Yeah, it's um, you know. a bit generous. Yeah. I'm not saying he's wrong, but like, yeah. bro, you, you didn't know this girl. You still don't know this girl. I'm also not going to pass judgment on people doing what they need to do to get ahead. 100. As long as it's not terrible. Oh, not yeah, like yeah, Amber yeah, Lee. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't be like using or abusing anyone. No. I remember to invite as many people from my fan club to opening night just rehearsal. Filled with people who love me as much as you do. Yeah, that's exactly what she wants. You know it'd be great after all this work? Spa bath. Can you set it up for me? Yeah, I said make me one. Run one for me, will you? Then you can finish these. Man, when will you learn? Thanks, Bessie. She's never suggesting things for you. Yep. I can't believe you're signing her shit. Holy crap. <laughs> well, at least it's, uh, it's settling in. Mm. This is a big change. I don't think you're here. I mean, they are now, yeah. Yeah. The show is a girl's best friend. You want the best friend written out. Yeah. Get rid of one of our main characters a day before our dress rehearsal. Yeah, is it not too late for this shit? Way too late. Change that dog's part to a bark and play dead or I don't go on. Really, bitch? It would have been too late weeks ago. Yeah. Reasonable here. I'm a star! I don't have to be reasonable! If you were actually a star, you wouldn't be afraid of some dog's success. Yeah. Those mutts are bothering me all as much as their owners. Mm. I actually had one of them clean my toilet. She thinks she's an actress. Yeah. It was already pretty obvious, but... Um, she acts just like every other obsessed yeah. fan. Yeah, I mean, dude tried to tell you. Mm -hmm. Whatever his name is, pretty boy. Yeah, I think even then she knew it deep down. She, yeah, just, she, she totally didn't want to face it. 100. Everything you said, you were... Right? Totally 100? Mm -hmm. Yes. Thank you. And you knew it at the time, too. You must think I'm a total fool. But hey, no, better late than never. Yeah, exactly. Not total. Takes intelligence and maturity to apologize. Yeah. Maybe my dad was right. Maybe I should just go home and work for him. You've been working this whole time. Did I really think I was just going to come to Broadway and be a star? Yes. I think she just doesn't want to work for her dad, specifically. Sure. Because it's exactly how you think. It's perfect. I can relate to that. A lot of people can. Perfect is so hard. It doesn't prepare you for disappointment. You still look adorable, even when you're disappointed. Sure. Yeah, that doesn't help. Yeah. There is not lights bright enough to contain the fame you're gonna have. Okay. Yeah, but not the way I've been doing it. The Sharpay you know isn't the Sharpay that has become the Sharpay. Yeah, so if you changed once, you can do it again. I'm glad she can keep track of all that. Yeah. I sacrifice integrity for opportunity. But you can keep growing, dude. Yeah, exactly. I let someone insecure distract me. Who you are is fluid. It yeah. changes all the time. Yeah. Worst of all, I disappointed someone I care about. Not him. Yeah. I forgot what was really important to me. Him? Yeah, no, I think she means him. I lost track of what I want. I would love it if she meant boy, but I don't think she does. <laughs> yeah. Other than maid service and a canopy bed, what is it that you want? A fair fight. Okay, cool. Nice. A lifetime in the spotlight. I mean, sure. And maybe you'll still let me be in your movie. I'm glad that they're going subtle on the romance. Yeah, well, here's the thing. I'd be happy for them to do it more if they just did it. But, like, don't base the romance around this kind of story. Yeah. Line, if that makes sense. Yeah. You could have this as well as that. I don't know. I like it. I like, no, they, I like what they're, they're doing. Light, I'm just saying, saying that if works. they were doing it more, they could. Yeah. Just you got to do it right. Yeah, exactly. Like, I didn't want them to kiss in that scene. No, absolutely you know not. I mean? I'm very happy they didn't. Yeah. It's not a good no, way to get into yeah, it. Yeah, it's going to say, like, bro, I hope he doesn't just try to start macking on her. Yeah. <laughs> Time and place, man. Yeah. You know? <laughs> These two, on the other hand. Sure. Can't say I approve of dating beneath your station in life, but fine. I'm sorry, beneath? <laughs> oh, God. I'm pretty sure that other kid's richer than you are. <laughs> Just saying. I don't think that counts for anything. It's his parents' money. She's, well, no, she's talking about <laughs> station in life. Uh, They've got the same fucking position, really. Sure. <laughs> 
Now mug him. <laughs> What's C-Q-M-T-W-I-L-G-T? Come quick, major trouble. Wow, I look great right today. Duh. Okay. Naturally. Really should have gotten that. Sure. Amber Lee Adams isn't what you think. Self-absorbed panther who would eat her young life on a reality show. Okay, so she is what you think. Okay, she's what you think. Yeah. Yeah. Kids shop. Mm. As long as Countess is at her side on that stage. That's what I'm trying to tell you. She wants the part of the dog written out completely. That's not fair! <laughs> Too far. Mm, Twelve, remember? <laughs> oh, thank you. We need to form an alliance and work against a common enemy. Is it? Amber Lee. <laughs> Trust me, the zip battle is one you won't win. Yeah. What can we do? This movie has some surprisingly quality lines. It has some good stuff. Yeah. Okay, we need to show people exactly who Amber Lee really is. I like the way you think. It's manipulative, but for a good cause. <laughs> it tracks that you would like that. Yes. Chaotica good. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Amber Lee, where have you been? I have been trying to reach you all day. Sorry, my phone must have been turned off. Without asking me first? Holy shit. Mm. I know you chose Countess for this performance tonight, and I'm fine with that. Well, it was nothing personal, but your phone was shut off. So oh. I guess that won't happen again, will it? N no. no. But not in the way you're thinking. No, yeah. <laughs> Hug? Okay. Oh. She's gonna plant a sisters. microphone on her. <laughs> yeah. Bestie. There you go. Yeah, there oh. it is. You'd think she'd feel that. You'd think. Okay, packed house for the dress mm -hmm. rehearsal. Holy crap, what's, what's going on? Oh, all right. Ah, <laughs> fighting their way through the curtain. They can be tricky. Mm. I'm Gil, the director. And I'm Neil, the underappreciated writer. <laughs> That's not a joke. <laughs> Does everyone here know how to applaud? Okay. Cool. Sure. Oh, you're Somebody please control these wannabe werewolves. I'm the star, not them. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Stop took you so long to hurry up and get these bleeping fur bags out of here. They don't even need the microphone. You're just behind the curtain yeah, and yelling. She should totally be able to hear herself. I think all these freaks with no lives came to worship no name much. Bro. And see the light coming through. Come on. They came to see. I mean, it's always fun yeah. to have this kind of moment. Sure. It's just not as impactful as it could have been. Yeah. You know? I like the idea that the stage people just rolled with it because they're like, yeah. yeah, fuck this person. Yeah. <laughs> I knew I forgot to tell you something. Your mic's on. You ruined me! Yeah. Well, I mean, you did it to yourself. Let's yeah. be real. You ruined you. The only reason you even wanted to be my friend is so I choose your dog. Oh, so now she gets the part in the play. Yeah, of course. Yeah. I idolized you. Even more than myself, which isn't easy. <laughs> you and I are exactly alike. Except I don't use people to feel better about myself. Yeah. She could have been that way. Yeah. But she ain't. She was on track. Yeah. She's not going to end but... up that way, though. Yeah. I'd be embarrassed if someone thought I was like you. Oh, Damn straight. Isn't that nice? <laughs> well, I quit. Go. Cool. Sure. Bye. Bye, Felicia. Without me, there's no show. Come on, Sharpe. Blame her! You learned all the lines for sure. She definitely did. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa, buddy. Hey, he didn't deserve that. Pretty sure that was assault. <laughs> Sorry, someone had to say it. I'll go talk some sense into her. Yeah, this is kind of not great for them. You, out of this theater now. Seriously, dude. <sighs> she screwed over the show. <laughs> I know. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> That's months of planning, writing. Sharpay, if you go, I'll go too. Aww. Aww. You wanted this as badly as I did. You win. It's not what it feels like. If there was ever a time for some ridiculous bullshit where she gets the part. Yeah, this is it, but I like the reality of it. I do, yeah. I was going to say somehow this feels more real than High School Musical than I realized. Well, I mean, it's her coming out of high school. She's yeah. like 19 now. Yeah. In the real world. I like it. They put a good amount of effort into it. Mm. It's like a nice balance. Well, it's not a musical as well, so there's not as much of that, like, fantasticness about yeah. it. Yeah, it's a music movie. Yeah. But not directly a musical, I agree. You're really leaving, huh? I'm packing my carry-on stuff first. Ah. <laughs> Holy shit. Have you thought about what you're gonna do now? Move home where there's enough room for my pores to open, and mostly miss you. Okay, is it fucked that I believe the chemistry between them more than the chemistry between Troy and Gabriella? It's a little fucked, but I'm with you. <laughs> like, I'm sorry, I feel the friendship, the bond between them, that's more because, so? That's because there's more story with just them. <laughs> yeah. We do get yeah. more of their actual development. They have more to work with, that's fair, yeah. but just... No, I agree. Goddamn, it's the flagship relationship of the entire franchise. Come on, guys. <laughs> yeah. I know exactly how to help that. Don't go. I already talked to my dad. We're not even fully leaning into this romance, and we're no. still more believable. Yeah, I know. I guess I'm gonna start. Oh. 
You don't have to say it. Thank you. If you say it three times in the mirror, it appears behind you. <laughs> what about you dream of being a star? It's just a little bit more of a dream than a reality. You got here exactly one month ago. Then you still have eight hours. <laughs> Make the best of them. Make it work. This isn't how my movie's supposed to end. Yo, it's a documentary. They don't always have happy endings. Yeah, happy. exactly. <laughs> Documentaries have like really depressing endings most of the time. Quite often. No, no, I'll be there. That was the stage manager. They want me to come to the theater and clear out boys' things. Aww. I can go with you if you want. I want. Make the appeal. Take the pot. Amber Lee has quit. The producers feel we can't open. It would cost too much to keep the production going. Yeah, it's obviously going to be Chappé. We want you all to know it was great almost working with you. <laughs> well, I mean, you did work with them. Yeah. Up to this point. <laughs> for, for the record, in reality, <laughs> yeah. this would be super fucked because Chappé just screwed a bunch of people yeah. out of their jobs. Yeah. Doesn't matter how much of a absolute monster the leading person is being. Yeah. These people are not getting paid now or at least not getting paid anymore. After this point. Yeah, 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 after this point. All their hard work amounts to no final product. Yeah, that's which unfortunate. Sucks, you mm -hmm. know? But luckily, this is a movie. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna meet you outside. Here you go. Here's someone who can fill the role. Yeah. I guess they just don't know that yet. Also, that wouldn't happen in real life because no, she's, she's not a big enough name. 100%. <laughs> but we're doing this for a reason. Mm. We are so, so sorry, people. Okay. Wait! Oh, is he gonna be him? He's gonna do it? And I was like, how are we gonna get to Chappé being the lead here? Mm. There's someone who knows the part by heart and who is amazing. Uh, maybe she's not a star yet, but she will be. Just watch. Gonna show them the documentary. I love how everyone's just rolling with this. Like, yeah, fuck it, why not? Uh, yeah, yeah. It's better than going home. Yeah. Boy, go Mark. Good. Stay. Ah, I love when you use that accent. <laughs> okay, now let's do the scene where the character Lenore thinks she's lost everything. Shelby, what is going on? Nothing is working out the way I planned it. I mean, she's lived this, so she would be great for the role. Yeah. I got something inside of me. Oh, we got a song. Nice. Deep down a voice is guiding me. Hidden emotions have stirred. I mean, they weren't going to do a Sharpe movie without her having a swan song. Come on. <laughs> Obviously, yeah. Well, I figured she'd have at least the final performance. Yeah. Whatever it is, I'll do it. Nobody else compares. I'm New York's best kept secret. This is nice. It's surprisingly more down to earth movie than I feel like yeah. the High School Musicals were. I feel like that's the most surprising part. Well, I thought this like, would be more along the lines of Confessions of a Teenage Drama Queen, to be honest. Well, I thought it'd be better than that, but it's like, it's Sharpay's fabulous adventure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fabulously realistic. Oh, better for sure, <laughs> but I thought more fantastical. Yeah, that's what I mean. In that same style. Yeah. That's this is good. It's appropriate to her character development, though. I, I, I like yeah, it. No, I love it. It's yeah. just surprisingly <laughs> grounded. I've got to shake up was a very smart way to conserve the budget. Mm -hmm. Hey, it's just him recording her in an empty theater. It's totally realistic to the story. Yeah. <laughs> and I like the end result too. Yeah, exactly. But if I miss my window. Perfect example of when you tone back the theatrics, you can emphasize the emotional impact a little more. Yeah. Okay. All right. Whatever you want, stop looking. Gabriella who? Yeah. <laughs> you know the thing that gets me about this performance right now is we're going to have to cut lots of it. I know. I I'm know. actually disappointed about that. I know. We'll I try, like this. We'll try to keep the best parts. Oh yeah, for sure. You'll be totally impressed. Best kept secret. It was a really nice performance. Mm. I could nitpick some things if I really wanted to, but I don't think it's necessary. Nah. It was emoted well, yes. you know what I mean? Yeah, I like that. Mm -hmm. Cool. Oh, everyone's just like feeling it. Well, did I tell you? Hey. Amazing! Oh, right. Uh. You have more depth and tone in one note than Amber Lee had in her entire surgically reshaped body. <laughs> Bro. Come on, don't shame her for that. That's a bit much. What are you saying? We need you to save the show. Obviously. Come on. Yeah. We know it's a risk. A gamble. A risk. Did I do risk already? You did. You did. True, we did fire you. But now I'm unfiring you. Can we do that? <laughs> Just did. Good for us! <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> uh, these guys are fantastic. <laughs> these guys are so funny. I, I guess we could get everyone used to hearing the song sing on key, but there's one condition. Boy and Countess split the role of Shelby the dog equally. Huh. Okay. Two dogs. She can have two dogs. You can't just have two dogs in the roles. Yeah. Just duplicate the roles or something. Yeah. yeah. Done. Let's rehearse, people. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, those guys are so funny. But yeah, like the trading back and forth. Like that. That's great. They got rhythm. No, I meant the those two. Oh, yeah, right, no, yeah, I was yeah. talking about the dogs oh, on yeah, stage. Sure, sure, sure. But yeah, those two are fucking fantastic. <laughs> A chance you've been waiting for. What if I'm not ready for this? Ready isn't as ready as you are. There's no such thing as ready. You just gotta do it. What if I forget my lines? Everything in your life has been leading you to this moment. Brace it. I hate that I'm invested in their relationship. They look so similar. <laughs> they I look know. like they could be related. Ah, oh, oh, damn it. Girl. You had to say it right then. Like, I know. Like, yeah. you, you stop and think about it. Yeah. 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 Could, yeah. Van Houten syndrome. Yeah. Let's reverse people. <laughs> Holy shit. <Jesus. laughs> You really ruined that moment. I did. <laughs> hey, if I couldn't enjoy it, you don't get to enjoy it. And neither do you. The, her parents came? Okay. Yeah, damn right they did. Yeah. Nice. He's introducing himself. See, you know how much he looks like he could be related to her? For a split second, I thought it was Ryan. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. I was like, Ryan's here. It's Yay. Like, like, oh, wait. No. No. Um, it's a new boyfriend. It's a boyfriend. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I appreciate that neither of us look like we're dating relatives. Yes. Weird thing to have to specify, but uh, apparently. <laughs> Got a feeling inside of me, a world about to change. I really wish they just gave her like a face mic or something so I wouldn't be taken out of the performance. Because <laughs> <laughs> I can very clearly hear this was recorded through a mic. Right. And I know that most people won't. Okay? Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh, It, annoying me. It could be in the ruffles sure. on the dress. Okay, it could what? be hidden. I'll, I'll take that. She's got a hidden mic in the ruffles. Mm -hmm. Okay. This song is actually pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. It's interesting because it's like, it's not as well made or produced or anything compared to the last movie or last two movies. Yeah. But. The, the writing and performances. Solid. Yeah. I don't even know if they're necessarily better or worse or whatever. It's just like, I feel it more. The performance is having the opportunity to breathe better exactly. in this instance. Yeah, yeah, I totally agree. Starting tonight, but I'm gonna take a leap of the rest of my life. But I think when you have a limited budget, that's all you can do is I just know. focus on the basics. Yeah. And when you get your basics mm. fucking solid, mm. you notice, yeah. you know? Yeah. I like uh, limitations on stuff like this sometimes for yeah. that specific reason. It forces you to be creative yeah. with how you make it happen. Limitations always breed innovation. That's why I think there's such a thing as too much choice. Exactly. That's what I'm talking yeah, about. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. You just end up piling up everything in the kitchen sink Yeah. when you didn't really need it. Okay, is it me or is it one of those guys just straight up look like Drew Gooden? One of the dudes in the hat. All right. <laughs> There he is. <laughs> I'm not seeing it. Eh, could be he's just a white guy. <laughs> Drew Gooden, just some white guy. <laughs> There's a reason people mistake him and Danny Gonzalez all the time. <laughs> They're not the same guy. They're I don't know anymore. <laughs> <laughs> they are not the same person. They're uh, not. There was a song about it. <laughs> Reference the material, yeah. okay? Uh, that was great. I liked that way more than I thought I would. Yeah, same. Yeah. And fucking wrapping it up with fabulous. I do appreciate course. that. Yeah. I figured that'd be like fun and light. Yeah. And it was fun and light, but it was also more real than I was expecting from a movie like yeah, this. Yeah, way more grounded and emotional. Mm. Just and I know that sounds somewhat insulting, but I'm sorry. It's low budget and sometimes that's good and sometimes it's bad. Yeah, In this exactly. case, it's good. They made it work for them yeah. by realizing that they could not have the same strengths that the other installments in the series had. Yeah, so you work so with what you've got. They work with what they got. You yeah. polish the things you have. Yeah, you know. and what they polished was the performances and writing. Fucking worked out. That was, like, that was nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I love the characters, yeah. the relationships. A yeah. lot of it was pretty predictable, but when it's done well, yeah. it doesn't even matter. I knew that Shelby was going to be the villain. Yeah. I knew that Sharpe and the kid, I forgot his name, were going to have like a rivals to yeah. partners kind yeah, of yeah, thing yeah. going on. There's nothing surprising about the story. Yeah, and I knew that the guy was going to be the love interest, sure. but it was just done well. Yeah, the question know? isn't, have we seen the story before? The question is, how well is the story executed? And in this case, pretty good. Pretty fucking good. Yeah, All things considered. Yeah, it was yeah. great. 
we will continue with more of these decoms and stuff in the future. We're yeah. just going to break them up a bit with some other stuff as well. Yeah, we're trying to get it a more well spread out source yeah, a bit more of balanced. content. A yeah. <laughs> little bit of mainstream, a little bit of slightly yeah. less, you know. Sprinkled around. <laughs> yeah, that kind of thing. Yeah. But, you know, until next time, you've been with Sam. Steph. We're the movie buds. buds.